Okay, let's see the tunnel. Oh, okay. uh, remember back in the middle dungeon, I did mention of a very big tunnel that starts in the to the door we call the door of no return. Now the English colonizers were so much afraid of the African men in the male dungeon uh, because of that. They never allowed them to walk through this courtyard to the door of no return. They rather chained all the African men in the male dungeon and forced them through the tunnel to the door of no return. Now this part of the tunnel system is not the exit. This part is the security post. This is where the English colonizers would stand with guns and urge the African men to go through to the door of no return. Now, if your men refuse, they will intentionally shoot you. Now, the, the, the sound of a gun alone is enough to humble people. The moment about two of them were shot dead, every one of them carried to the door of no return. And these cannonballs and cannons were brought here by the English colonizers. Now, where we just came from, that small cell there, closer to that small cell, these chambers you see were all warehouses full of gold. European stood not of gold from that. Now, because of the gold, there was a strong rival. When the English were here, the French, the Dutch, the Swedish, the Portuguese wanted to seize this slave castle from them. So these were the defensive tools the English were using to protect the castle. Anytime the English colonizers saw other Europeans coming, they would quickly pull the balls inside the cannons and fire them. These balls, were, when being fired, go very far away from here. A kilometer, 900 meters, 800 meters, and they exploded. There was this professor from France who came here the last time. He said, Tony, do you know why Europeans enslaved Africans for so many centuries? I said, no. He said it was because of these cannonballs and cannons. I thought twice, and I realized that it was making sense. And the same thing is still going on. The US, China, Russia, they're investing a lot to uh, weapons. Yeah. Whoever that controls weapons controls the world. Nothing has really changed. Now, let me show you the tunnel. This is the middle part of the tunnel. I'm going to show you another middle part, and then we'll move to the end part of the tunnel. After that, we are going to go through the female dungeon, and now I'm going to show you a door we call the door of return. Now there's a door here we call the door of return. There's no door of return in the Alina Castle. And that door of return is not part of the castle system. It's not part of the castle system. It was introduced by a group of our brothers and sisters in the Dahaspa. You know, they came, they came here with us. And that door, the significance of that door is to encourage our brothers and sisters like you to reconnect with the ancestral heritage. In 2019, oh my God, we did receive a lot. Steve Harvey came here, Boris Kujo, T.I., Rhoda Chris, Beyonce's mother. And we, we were very happy to see them come here, to the mother. Well, hopefully have a, a strong impact on them to join them, the movement of us reconnecting to Africa. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The fight is in Africa. We have to do, you know, do the works here. Yeah, we have to. We are doing our very best. You know, we believe that self-education is very powerful. Yeah. We are trying our very best to educate it, our own people. It's all hands on deck, you know. We're all a part of the, the whole the movement, movement that has to happen. Yeah. So you, you know, when, I, when we bring people here, we let people know that it's up yeah. to them. You, you look familiar to me. To me. <laughs> yeah, but, um, um, but a whole lot of times, more yeah, than I can you, count. You know, yeah. we, record, yeah. we record everything all and put it all online. Everything. It twice a year. Oh, yeah, it looks everything very popular. Everything is online. You, so. look, you, you know Black and Abroad, Prince? Prince. No. I, don't uh, that look dangerous? Yeah, black and abroad. You don't know him? Black and abroad prince now. He's one of the famous Ghana YouTubers. No, 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 he's not. He's not a YouTuber. He's a, he's a businessman. He organizes a lot of tours for the US, for blacks in the US. Oh, perfect. Sound like somebody you need to get to know. Yeah. Yeah, there you go, family. It's a whole lot of us and other people out there you know, bringing energy together. 
international family. We're all here telling our story before. From, from the Afrocentric perspective. Yeah, before we, we, you know, we had to just read books and information that misled us and to, uh, told us something else. Now we're exactly. able to go to the source of the documentation and get information about people who have... Now, this is still the tunnel system. There you go, family. It's still the tunnel. Frankly, I'm not going to be so. We, 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 we can go. It's not going to be impossible. I'm going to film as well. I'm going to end. Oh no, we are saying it's very difficult. Yeah, I'm going to end. Yeah, yeah. We're going to end the tour. We go for two. Okay, that's perfect. I'm going to come back. I'll just summarize it. That's perfect. Yeah. But this is still the tunnel system. No, we just saw one of one of the security points. This is another security point, and that is another security point also. Yes. So the, the cross check, you know, the check was the African men were walking through to the exit. I'm going to take you to the exit. <coughs> but uh, uh, before you go, this, if you do, you do you want to have a look? Yeah. Yeah. Would you like? No, you don't walk. No, no, no. Just take a step. You watch your hand. You have a look and you come out. Please, wait, wait. It's very deep. Yeah, please don't go too far. Uh, you know, it's Sunday, all of the doctors in the country are off. <laughs> the family, it is beautiful African sun. And this uh, other cool chilling. And this is I family, but money time, but in the flesh. Yes, I've been to the Cape Coast African Holocaust dungeons. I want to say at least 16 out of 19 times I've been to Ghana. And it's all been an energy of bringing new people with us. That's a personal and a private and a business mission. And the, like last night, we just enjoyed the energy of One Africa. You know, a tenor is different, but it gives you all of the elements of what we call a root and culture journey. Mm -hmm. It's title repatriation and investment because that is the direction of the focus, but it's always a root and culture base, regardless on every trip, tour that we do. I wouldn't waste my time and energy. My goal is to empower us based on the greatness of us as a people and our ancestors. Thank you so much. So family, the journey continues. Okay, this way, please. So you can speak to me. Yeah, we could.